In this comeback, I sort of decided to forego all of my superstitions, and I, I was a little he killed <laughs> it too. crazy about that before. Meditation's become a big part of my pre-race routine and, and my daily life routine, and uh, so I just make sure I find some time to get in the right headspace, and, and that helps me get in the zone for when I race. Pre-race ritual, I would always go for a drive or a walk or some sort of a clearing of head moment, uh, playing just like my favorite music and rolling the windows down, cranking the heat because it's middle of winter. We do have a root, like more of a routine and I think that's normal because athletes are creatures of habit and so we like to control as much as possible and just sort of go through a certain set of actions that put us into the right headspace. I always put my left equipment on before my right, so like my left shin pad, my left skate, my left elbow pad. I like to put um, my left ski on first usually, but then sometimes I forget about that and for a race I'll like always put my right one on. I still tie my left ski first always. <laughs> you let go of some things, yeah. baby steps. I used to be very particular about how my guards were placed on the boards or I used to, um, you know, even with my water bottle or have a certain thing in my pocket or whatever, so yeah. I'm, I'm better about that, yeah. <laughs> Part of this whole a new approach mentally into skating and, and competing is is throwing that concept of superstitions out the window because I think it's ridiculous. If something goes wrong with your superstition, like let's say you have a favorite animal or something, you bring it to the track with you and you forget it, then you're kind of rattled, right? A big thing for me is to embrace the unknown now and embrace, especially in skating, how sometimes you could feel great and you can have some of the worst skates of your life. I haven't quite kicked this one, but I spit, which they always catch on camera. I'm like, why do I do that? It's so bad. Um, but then the night before, I always eat a steak. I pretty much wear the same long johns every single race for like the last three years. What are the shape of those long johns now? They're pretty good. They're all right, yeah. They only get, they only get worn like 20 times a year, so. I really like holding my sled before I go. Some people have it put down for them and like they move it, but I'm like, no, this is my time. I like staring either people down or staring the track down before I go. 